first, a close call for a family in Collin County after a small plane crashes into their home, coming just feet from hitting a one-year-old boy. We're glad you're with us. Two people inside the plane were hurt. This crash happened about 5 p.m. yesterday at a home near Virginia Parkway and Independence Parkway. This is on the west side of McKinney. CBS 11, Jonah Gavino joins us now live with the efforts underway to remove that plane. Yona. Ross Cruz may have to use a crane to pull the plane out. The McKinney Fire Department says no one on the ground was hurt, but you can see the home was seriously damaged. Ten feet, a McKinney mom says that was the distance between her one-year-old son and a small plane that crashed through her living room yesterday. Homeowner Jamila Foster and her family live about a quarter mile from Arrow County Airport. Some residents are now very concerned. We talked to neighbors who saw one woman inside the plane. She seemed to be okay. The other was carried out on a stretcher. They both went to the hospital to be checked out. This neighbor rushed over minutes after it happened. It was just a loud crash. So we knew it was something crashing, but we didn't know it was actually the plane. And the lady was outside with her baby, and I asked her what happened, if everything was okay. And she said, no, I have a plane. She's landed in my house. And I don't know if anybody is okay. And then everybody started coming in, and then they took two old people out. Back out here live, the house is now taped off. We did reach out to federal authorities to try to get an update on the passengers in that plane, and we will be sure to share that information with you guys once we learn it ourselves. Live in McKinney, Yona Gavino, CBS 11 News.